Etrachan saw it. I'm Katsura. This is something that happened to me when I was in Hokkaido for a business trip. Look at all that snow. I better leave early, just in case the snow gets worse. So I left a bit early and headed to the airport. Here you go. Thank you. The driver was used to the snow. It was snowing a lot, but the bus got there right on time. I got here way too early. Let's get some food. I ate some sushi for lunch. Then I went to the lobby to wait for my flight. Phew! Now that I think about it, I should have checked in my luggage when I got there. If I had, none of this would have happened. About 30 minutes later... Alright, I should get going. Huh? My bag! It's gone! Can't be! It was right next to me! Oh no, no! I can't lose that bag! Um, sorry to bother you. I was just sitting there with this paper bag. Did you see anyone take it? Huh? Um, sorry. No. Okay. Oh no. The bag belonged to a customer. I was taking it back for repairs. And it was a custom model. It was irreplaceable. I gotta find it! I walked around the airport asking if they had seen my bag. I looked everywhere. But, uh, I couldn't find it. What if the person that took it went outside with it? But I don't know. Maybe they went to the security checkpoint. Ah! <gasps> what was that? Where did it come from? Uh, the security checkpoint. <gasps> no. It can't be. What is that thing? Is that real? Let me through. Sorry. <gasps> there it was. The contents of my bag! The family standing in front of the basket looked terrified! What is this? How am I supposed to know? You're the one that tried to bring it on board. This isn't mine! Throw it out! Um, excuse me! That's mine! I've been looking all over for it! What? <laughs> Azami, you said you bought these. Huh? Ah. Uh... How do we know you're telling the truth? Got any proof? What are these things anyway? The metal detector went off. Oh, this! It's called Mechanimal. You know, those moving models of animals you see at museums and stuff? I work for a company that manufactures these. I was planning to send them via mail. My business card should be in the bag if you want to check. Ah, he's right! But then, why did she have it with her? <gasps> it's not what you think! I didn't steal it! I took it by accident! And what the hell is this anyways? You shouldn't be walking around with this stuff! You're crazy! Uh... Okay then, um... I'm gonna let the police take it from here. Could you guys move aside? The other passengers need to get through. Hey! Police! You calling me a thief? How dare you! Screw this! Uh, what? Take that! Stop it, you idiot! I'm so sorry! I'm sure this is just some misunderstanding! Um, we'll pay for the model! 50,000? Uh? That lizard! It cost 50,000 uh, dollars! 50,000?! <laughs> what?! Stop kidding around! This is just a toy! Stop lying to us! I'm not! And it belongs to one of my customers! I was taking it back for repairs! So it's not even mine. Oh no. I'm terribly sorry. Apologize now. Uh. Then the police arrived. They took her away. Ah! I had to go down to the station and explain things to the police. Needless to say, I missed the flight. A few days later, sir, what should we do about the lizard model? Oh, we're gonna make her pay for it, that's for sure. She'll just pay us back $10,000 a month. Easy, right? I'm gonna take some interest, though, so... <laughs> I'm so sorry. I should have been more careful. Yeah. The company sued her for damages. She had no choice but to pay for everything. 
Worst case scenario, the courts will foreclose her assets. After that, I went to see the customer to apologize to her in person. We offered to remake the model, free of charge. Oh dear, I'm so sorry to hear that. I'm terribly sorry. The outside is fine, but the parts on the inside got shattered. Oh, no worries. I got time. And this is for you. I know it doesn't make it right, but... Oh, wow! It's a gift. It's the newest model of the Etra Sea Snake. You sure? Thank you! She was really nice and understanding. Thank goodness. A few months later, we fixed her lizard and sent it back to her. The lady and her husband ended up paying us $50,000 plus interest for damages. Not sure how they came up with the money, but... Oh well. I'm not paying for this! Yes you are! Honestly, I don't want to know. If my wife did something like this, I'd get a divorce and take the kid with me. Same here. I just hope everything works out for the kid. ご視聴いただきありがとうございました。私もお気引きの被害には会いたくないので、自分の荷物は膝の上に置くとか、肌身張らさずにしてます。こういう風に自衛するのも大事と言いたいところですが、そもそも盗みを働く方がおかしいん